Hi all, in this video, I am going to list out some of the AI presentation maker tools to all of you. Up to now, we may be preparing a PPT with the use of the Microsoft Office. But here, I am just going to introduce some of the tools related to the artificial intelligence, how the AI is going to help you to prepare a PPT tools I am going to list out you. The first tool which I like to do the demo, that's called gamma.app. So after creating an account, we have to go to the create new options. In this create new options, we have the options called text or generate or import your file. So just I like to go to generate. When you go to generate AI, we have the option like presentation document web page. Like I like to go with the presentations. When you go to the presentations, it asking the title here. So we should type here topic, uh, that topic which I like to prepare a PPT. That here I like to prepare a PPT related to the gamification. Then after this, there is a send button. If you click the send, the A is going to list out some of the subtitle or that slides to title. Suppose if you want to modify the topic, we have to modify the topic by manually. When you click the continue, the third step is asking to select here templates. So they are given some kind of basic templates. Then after that click continue. So once you click the continue, within a few seconds, we may get a wonderful PowerPoint which is prepared by the artificial intelligence. Now you can see the, how this PPT is generated by artificial intelligence tool of gamma.app. The second first slide, second slide, third slide, the psychology of gamification. So still you are getting a generation. Don't close this tab while generating is in the progress. So now we may get a wonderful PowerPoints uh, with the title of gamifications. So I hope you understood how the A is helping to generate a PPT. And after preparation, suppose you want to do further modifications. We have here a lot of options in the right side. See, this is slide one, slide two. Suppose you want to modify something, we have the A, edit with A option is there. Then card templates, if you want to modify, text formatting, then call out blocks and layout options. This is for the visual template. This is for the add images. Suppose you want to add some embedded videos, then embedded apps and web pages. This for the forms and buttons like this they give a lot of options in this suppose you want to further modification in the slide which is generated by a you can do the manual editing or suppose if you want to depends on the a based uh, editing so after selecting particular text you want to modify then go with edit with uh, text it asking this uh, more engaging if you click this more engaging a giving some other suggestion for enriching the title so here i'm just uh, selecting uh, the suggested title which is given by the AA. So now I got a new title. So like this we have to be customize the title based on the AA. Suppose after finishing that you want to be uh, go for a presentation, click this presentation mode. When you go to the presentation mode, this comes to the presentation mode. Then the slide one, slide two, we can modify with the use of the keyboard. Suppose you want to come back to the editing mode, press the escape button with keyboard. Now I come back to the editable mode. And then after that if you want to go for some kind of downloading, we can click this the three dots near to our profile photo there is an option called export in this export we have the option like export to pdf export to powerpoint suppose you like to download a powerpoint you can click export to powerpoint then within a few seconds there will be a powerpoint is downloaded then after you can do further editing with the use of uh, without online because after downloading the powerpoint you can do editing in the case of offline so that is possible in this case hope this particular tool is very useful for you and similarly, I'm going to introduce the, the second tool, which is very much essential to all of you. That's called slidespilot.com, slidespilot.com. So here, once you create an account, go to my workspace. There, the similar kind of options like create a new, click a create a new. Then we have to give the title. For example, I like to go with micro learning. I'm just typing the title as a micro learning. Then go with the enter. The same like Gamma app, the features. Then after this, it lists out some of the subcontents. So when you click the continue, you may get a PowerPoint that's similar like uh, gamma.app. Hope you are getting how to do this. So this is a second tool which I like to give you input to you. So after getting this, you may get this kind of PowerPoint. See here, I am already create a lot of PowerPoint in this. And similarly, I like to introduce the third tool, presentarywondershare.com. Uh, this is a tool. After creating an account, you may get this kind of uh, templates. So see this link, presenterwondershare.com slash app dot slash dashboard. Then if you like to create a PPT, go to the create a presentation AI. 
then it asking the title then give the title like I am like to go with the micro teaching so give this micro teaching then go to the send when I click the send within a few minutes it's existing a uh, some subtopics yeah so suppose the subtopic if you want to modify or you want to do the editing you can do the editing manually then go to the next step when you click the next steps the third step is asking uh, templates kindly selected templates for this presentation click generate then within a few seconds you may get a wonderful powerpoints uh, then after that if you want to download as a pdf that also possible in this case so here we can download only the pdf version it takes few seconds to be generated ppt yeah now you can see so it's generating a wonderful powerpoint so micro teaching enhancing teacher development even the right side i mean right side or left side of our videos also may be embedded so when you created it asking to add your camera then you add the camera then you may get your the side view of our presentation view then you can go for a presentation and you can record it also with this kind of third party tool this was the export to PDF. We can download as a PDF. So see the second slide, third slide, fourth slide, fifth slide. Like this, it may be helping to create a lot of PowerPoint. Yes, now I am to the the next tool that's called Tome.app. T O M E dot app. Tome dot app. So here also the similar kind of features available. So when you like to create, go to the create button. Just document to presentation. Here we have to give you a title. So when you give the title, automatically the PowerPoints will be generated. These are the slides which I prepared like uh, breaking about unleashing the powerpoint experimental research like this and here also the right side we have a lot of editing options like add text add media add drawing add table then add chart lot of features are available the same like gamma app so the fifth tool which i like to do the demo that's called decto decto bus a this is an interface of this tool decto bus a then after this if you like to create a ppt just you can give the title here I like to go with this artificial intelligence, artificial intelligence in education. Then go to the generate my presentations. This is the interface of Dectorverse.com after the login. Then we have to tie, give this automatically the artificial intelligence based the title is generated, teachers and educator interest in corporate artificial intelligence classroom. After go to the next button. So when you go to the next, uh, we have uh, some subtitles, then we can go to the next. Uh, then it asks me whether you need a 10 minutes presentation or 25 minutes or 40 minutes. I can go with the 10 minutes, go to the next. Then it asking to select a presentation templates. Then click the generate temp presentations. Within a few seconds, the Dr. Buzz A is giving a wonderful slides to us. So kindly use this tool such as DectorBuzz.a. And the next tool which I like to do the demo, that's called slidesgo.com. Slidesgo.com slidesgo.com once you create an account in the slidesgo.com so we should go with try now so in this home page there is an option called try then make a cute presentation with the AI then click get started then we have to type here uh, the main topic for example I like to prepare a presentation in the title of uh, augmented reality augmented reality then whether write in tone in the professional way or the language so we, they given a lot of language even tamil also can be generating but i like to go with english then number of slides whether you need eight slides or ten slides i like to go with the eight slides then the third steps you have to select here yeah, templates so suppose i like to select this template and generate presentations within a few seconds a wonderful presentation is given by slides yeah so now it's the preparing hold on we are generating your presentations about augmented reality so it started to preparing so now there is a title which is generated by enhancing the realities and using this power of augmented reality. First slide, second slide, third slide, fourth slide, fifth slide. So like this, we may get a wonderful slides in this. Now we can see the slides. Wow, what a wonderful slides. So then after that, if you'd like to go with download, there is a download options. So here they're given some options like JPEG and PDF they provide. So the PPD is a paid one. So PDF and JPEG is possible to download it and if you like to go with the presentation mode click the presentation mode we can uh, get your presentations view also so this way we have to be use this um, a presentation tool now this is this interface of this uh, the presentation mode if you like to come back to the editable mode we can come to the edit, uh, escape button so this way we can use it hope this video is might useful for you to generate a lot of ppt with use of this much of EA tools thank you so much we'll meet in the next video bye